um, the private equity guys, uh, and I can already tell you, for example, uh, you know, the new company that's buying the big chunk of CenturyLink, they I don't are, know them. Uh, no, but, but they're, they don't even exist yet. That's why you don't know them. But, you know, they, they will probably come into official existence sometime before the end of the year. CenturyLink is already filing grants on their behalf left and right. Mm. And so, and they're completely fueled by private equity. So they're, they're essentially using the CenturyLink name to build huge amounts of new fiber. And it has nothing to do with that in the CenturyLink copper. I mean, and so that, that's absolutely driven by that. And they're going to count on, they normally wouldn't look good on grants because they're brand new, no experience, mm -hmm. blah, 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 blah. But, you know, they're, they're very smartly ponying on the fact that they bought these properties and I guarantee you they're going to go, they're going to go big time in here. You can just tell they're already filing them all over the place. I ran into half a dozen of them this week.